Time to go to work. Aha! Hmm, that thing looks whippable. Look what I found. how I didn't spot this before. If this is the prize, I'll lose my grant for sure. Where are the priceless artifacts? The gilded idols? The crowns of kings? Good news never travels that fast. Better get up there.
Now what? Sophia Hapgood. Hello, Indy. Been a while. I'll say. What brings you out west? Some psychic premonition about the treasures I should have found? My, look at these wonderful pot shirts. It's the new thinking in archaeology. Find some worthless debris, analyze it, understand prehistory. Kind of noble, don't you think? There's an iron curtain coming down on Europe, Indy. The Russians are taking over. I read the papers. Want a real chance to be noble? We need your help. Uh-huh. Who's we? When I joined during the war, it was the OSS. Now President Truman calls us the Central Intelligence Agency. Is that what you're up to these days? Soviet sabotage? Atomic secrets? Don't be silly. We've got whole battalions for that. It's my job to worry about more, uh, unusual activity. Such as this dig site on the Euphrates River, south of Baghdad. Babylon. Remember your Bible? That's where mortals raised the Tower of Babel to invade heaven. Well, you know, this does look like the ruins of a Timonanki. The ziggurat often identified with the tower. Very good, Dr. Jones. You're looking at the brainchild of one Gennady Volodnikov of the Leningrad Physics Institute. He thinks there's some truth to the biblical legend. Isn't he a godless communist? He's a physicist who studies manifolds in hyperspace. Quirky theoretical stuff. Well, what's a guy like that doing in Babylon? Not sure. All we really know is he thinks the atom bomb is a joke. Then why isn't the world laughing? Indy, suppose the tower housed some deadly force no one else had ever heard of. Something as dangerous as nuclear fission. And the Babylonians tore it down for reasons not discussed in the good book. Exactly. It's an amusing theory, but as you can see, I've got troubles of my own. You don't think I flew out here from Washington just to relieve your boredom, I hope. This came from the Russian dig site. Uh, somebody made a mistake. This looks like part of a steam engine, maybe a locomotive from the last century. There's no mistake. We've dated the thing. It's 2,600 years old. But really? Look at that little wheel spin. How'd you find it? Come on, Indy, we're the CIA. We have spies. 